In this video, I will show you how to easily add a reminder to your calendar using the Google Assistant or Google Gemini or using manually enter the details. Set a reminder for 1st of May for call, call it test 1 for the video about reminders. Test 1 for the video about reminders. This will be for May 1st. At what time? 11.30. Got it. I'll remind you on May 1st at 11.30 a.m. Okay, so now I did it. Let's see in the calendar. Let's see how it looks like. So if I open the calendar up, you will see it's already there. I have it set to May 1, so for the purpose of this video. And I, will, I could add another one. Set a reminder for May 1st on Labor Day about the title? The title should be test 2 for the reminder video. Okay, test it for the remainder video. This will be for May 1st. At what time? 12.30. Alright, I'll remind you on May 1st at 12.30 p.m. Okay. So it's already there. It has it there. Okay, I have these views now and you can change the view to daily or three days or week. You can have the calendar set to weekly and like this you can see the whole week or you can even have it set to monthly. You can have it set to monthly and then you see the whole month like this. The easiest is to have the calendar set to daily and how to add it manually. You can add a reminder manually. You go to the day you want to set the reminder on and you can go like this. You can browse from here, you can expand this, you can see the actual calendar. You can see going to the 2nd of May, for example. And here I see at 12, I have a time there and I can add some kind of a task or anything event. Call it test 3. And I have it set to 12, but you can also set it to whole day. But I'll leave it set at 12 there and I could also add notifications. It's 30 minutes before and I can add a notification two hours before, for example, and I could even have four hours before and this one. The 30 minutes before will have the bell there and you can remove the notifications, save it and it's there. And you can also send a link to someone if you want to use it as a voice video call or something so you can also use the plus here to say create a task test for i could have it all day there and this is going to be test for for the whole day and this is how you create reminders you can always go to the reminder and for this one for the test for for example i can mark it as completed. For the task, I can go to the task itself and mark as completed and it's crossed there so it's done like this. The calendar event, I can always go to the event itself and edit. I can change the date. I could change it to 14 to 2 p.m. for example and it changes there. Or I could change the date from 2 of May, 2nd of May. <laughs> I could change it to 1st of May and now it's test here test 3 and you see the previous ones that were created from the Google Assistant. I could mark these ones as complete, mark as complete and I could keep this one like that or I could delete it. So I showed you how to create reminders and even tasks, events in the calendar so you can easily get reminders, you can easily get reminded about things and you can do this with the voice assistant or manually in the calendar. It's much easier to do it with the Google Assistant. Thanks for watching.